Today is so exciting. This is our big for a day event. It's actually the biggest one that we've ever had. So we take waiting littles, kids who have been on our wait list and are waiting for a big brother or big sister, and we bring out volunteers from different companies and organizations and kind of pair them together through different activities to just kind of feel what it might feel like to be a that big brother or big sister. Our vision is that all youth achieve their full potential. We really believe that kids come to us whole and what they're looking for is a friend, someone to guide them. And so we take these littles, we call them littles, they're kids in our program, and we match them with adult mentors. So this event helps us to recruit more male mentors for that wait list of kids. You know, having a mentor is so impactful. They are there as to guide them, to be a friend, to kind of inspire them, show them things outside of their normal scope, and it just gives them kind of a new lease on life. There's always a need for volunteers, and that's because there's always a need for mentors. And so every time we move a kid off the wait list, there's another one in the valley who's waiting to be moved on. So we just are always in need of more mentors, and specifically men. We have a difficult time recruiting men, and so we're looking for events like this to kind of call out to men and say, hey, we really need your support here. Well, I actually was a volunteer for Big Brothers and Big Sisters for about three and a half years before joining as a member of the board. As a big for Big Brothers and Big Sisters, I had no idea how mutually rewarding it was going to be for both the big and the little, and it turns out to be a lot of fun. Uh, I think it's all about connecting with each other, getting the chance to get out and socialize, feeling more part of the community, and just making sure we all know each other a little bit more and understand what each other's about. When you become a, a big, I think the question I get the most for people who are considering it and not sure about themselves is they, they don't think of themselves as a mentor. They're not sure they can do it. And it's, it's really not a difficult thing to do. All you have to do is show up and be present and be a, uh, a stable figure in someone's life who maybe otherwise they don't currently have that. Just be yourself and uh, it is, it's a very mutually rewarding experience to be a big. I got partnered with a little, so it was a great time to be able to get to know somebody and be a part of the community and be able to see what Big uh, Brothers Big Sisters is all about. I just say thank you to Cost Communications for working for a great company and to be able to be a part of the Arizona Big Brothers and Big Sisters and to be able to put this together for the, the littles, I mean, because they're just such a great part of the community and the future of our community, right? And we want to be able to be a part of that with Cox Communications. We are so grateful for all of our amazing partners here in the Valley. It's so important. It really helps us to build our mission. It really helps us with our outreach. So we have a bunch of Cox employees here today who are interested in potentially becoming bigs. And so partners like that where it can help us expand our reach are really important. If you are interested in becoming a big brother or a big sister, please check out our website. Check us out, learn more, and come get involved.